Um, and, and that's really well done for the first time. It's amazing. <laughs> so one thing, you don't want to bend your wrist. Okay. So that's the difference between a, a ordinary, like a pencil or a pen, you'd be bending your wrist and it's all down in the fingertips. This one, what you do is you squeeze your palm. Imagine that you have a, a lemon. You just squeeze your palm, especially in the vertical strokes. And what that does is it actually lifts, lifts the brush mm -hmm. so that you can get uh, it steadies the brush too, so you have the most tension is right here on the palm of the hand. That's called teno uchi, mm. and and it's just like squeezing a lemon, and then uh, and and also each stroke has three parts: tones, 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 and you don't go too fast. So um, you want to make sure you have enough ink, but not too much. And now watch this next one; it has a lot of strokes, um, and this is down, cross, cross down. That's the main things. Down. Down, cross. cross. Just remember the first one, the next one's opposite. Cross down. And then this one is built this way. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. So, Kaisho block style is a bit like walking, gracefully. <laughs> and uh, Gyosho is a bit like dancing. And uh, Sosho is a bit like flying. And they each have different kind of rhythms. So we talked about the key line and the rhythm. And for Sosho, it's more like flying with pauses and swoops and flying. I like the Gyosho mm. better than Kaisho mm -hmm. because it's more like I can write rhythmical. Yeah, it has a rhythmical, yeah, yeah. it's almost musical, yeah. yeah. And, but it's hard to write the mm. thing. Thin lines, yes, yeah. thin, thin lines, lines are very challenging, yeah.